No doubt one would think Jacob Zuma's children got their riches on a silver platter after his thrust into power. Despite many linking his son due to Zayn Zuma's fortune to the Guptas, that hasn't been the case with the rest of the children. However, of interest is that Jacob Zuma's two daughters Gugulethu Zuma and Cuban and her sister Thuli Zuma have been making a fortune through acting. It might be puzzling since they haven't starred in any small screen drama series. Alas, the two are the co-owners of Stained Glass TV. However, in recent years the two have fast become Zancy's finest when it comes to soapy operas. Gugulethu Zuma became the queen of the drama series after he dethroned Mfundi Vunda's long-running drama series Generations with Uzlo as the most-watched drama series in Zancy. As if that's not enough, Stained Glass went down in the history books of soapy operas when Durban Gen's production reached the 2 million viewership mark in less than a month. Gugulethu Zuma Cube is the daughter of former President Jacob Zuma and Dr Nkosazan Adlamini Zuma. Interestingly, she is married to Zimbabwean's celebrated opposition bigwig Prof Welshman Cube's son. Cube's son is an academic genius with business interests in procurement, real estate and construction. However, it's puzzling that Gugu has been part of several hit drama series. Her thrust into the limelight when she was the presenter of the interrogation room in 2007. From there, she was cast into big budget drama series, thus, I Sitting aired on SABC3 and Ed's drama series Rhythm City. However, she has been heavily involved in content writing with the public broadcaster SABC News. In the wake of her newfound fame, she switched the floor to behind the cameras being the brains behind Uslo, Durban Jen and Ehastella. However, her illustrious career has seen many trying to connect the dots about her net worth. She keeps her private life under wraps, but Mzansi has managed to connect the dots about her net worth. Rumor Mill says Stained Glass owner has a whopping net worth of R320 million. She owns several properties across Mzansi and has been spotted driving some of the world's finest cars, including a limited range rover that costs around R3.5 million. Sources also have it that several joint venture businesses also give Gugulethu's net the nod with his husband, who is said to be a millionaire. Connie Ferguson's 2022 net worth. However, her staggering net worth has implicated Ferguson Films co-owner Connie Ferguson in the equation. The bubby actress who has made all sorts of headlines with her illustrious career has been reported to have an estimated net worth of R300 million. After all, it seems as if stained glass owner is richer than Connie Ferguson. However, despite being R20 million short of Gugulethu Zuma, Mzansi is more than convinced that Zuma's colossal chunk of net worth might have come through political connections and privileges. Connie Ferguson has fast become the goddess of small screens, and her illustrious career has seen her one of the highest paid actresses in Mzansi. Her thrust into the limelight came in the backdrop of her on-screen character on Generations. However, she later joined drama series under Ferguson Films. Since then, she has been winning big. Apart from acting, she doubles as a business mogul with a business interest in skincare and cosmetics. To cap her life of glitz and glamour, she has managed to cap herself with the finest things the world can offer, from a million rand mansion to exotic cars.